boy. Oh boy, did I just record a 10 minute podcast into my camera? Yes, was it recording? No, that lady looks like Susan Boyle. Shout out to her. Remember that fucking, that has to be one of the worst hands to be dealt. Fat ugly with the voice of an angel. That is tough sled. Maybe if the, if the trans movement was out before Susan Boyle, was it? She kind of missed the boat on that. Make a decision, cunt. What are we doing? I got 10 minutes to rip this pocket. I was just cooking for 20 minutes, and now I'm so mad. I, I, you know, we need to get in the intersection, Pop. What are we doing? Welcome to the Road Rage Podcast with Ryan Foster. I won't stop recording this podcast till I'm arrested for manslaughter. You know? Hopefully the cops are real one and deletes the recording when he arrests me. That would be tough. You know, you try to claim self-defense because you're assaulting an Uber driver and, uh... They played the tape on you. You know? They're like, did you really say that? I'm like, yeah, I did. That would suck. I'd have to leave my family. I'd have to touch my baby's beautiful little fat hand through glass. I'm in a bad mood, dude. I am in a bad mood. I had a good ra- road rage incident before I recorded this, yelling at a lady with a mask on in her own car. I fucking... Just, well, I don't even know if it was a lady. Can't assume anymore, you know? Not that it matters. You're whatever you think you should be. I think I am an NFL athlete. You know? You hear that? That's a cold brew that ain't working because daddy ain't sleeping. I thought a life of partying would have prepared me for fatherhood, but it didn't. You know? I'm the puke man, though. Nothing can gross me out. I have accepted that. 39th Street, we'll make a left. We'll make a left. I, um... What the fuck is good, brothers? Brothers and sisters? I wonder how many ladies listen to this. Three, you know? I, I just did a Valentine's Day show at fucking uh, Helium last night. And it's so fun to watch all attractive, like, hot comedy chicks. are like, I come walking up there. They're like, who's this fucking Paul Bunyan with the tequila soda? Who is this guy? You know? Their loins are firing because they're like, this dude's an alpha. It says it all over his face, you know? You can see it. You can look at the shoulders pinned back, confident. This guy looks like he likes Andrew Tate, but I don't. And then I start talking, and the chicks are like, I fucking hate this guy. You know? They always come up thinking, I should start doing more Chris D'Elia material to get the ladies to like me. Only people who like me, every time I do a show in Helium, you know, people will hate me, and then I get followed by, like, ten black guys. They're like, I like to cut this guy's jib. He's not scared, you know? Oh, my God. Yeah, like, what? What is my life? When will I sleep? I don't think I ever will again. Let's see if I can find this fucking church I gotta work out off memory. Dude, that's one thing. That's one rule in life. You see, I just saw a couple black guys getting the smoker going. They have, like, you know, one of them oil drums. If you see a black guy getting ready to cook on that, you pull over. You pull the fuck over, and you eat what he's cooking. If those guys were cooking, I would've stopped. Be like, I'll have a half of roasted chicken. It's the greatest thing you've ever had. Yeah, boy. There used to be a trash can guy, a trash can cooker guy in Jersey. I forget where the fuck it was. It was right near one of the jobs I was doing for like two years. And every Friday, I would go get a goddamn grilled chicken from that guy. Smoked. Smoked it. It's also like, what fucking fat guy figured that out? Smoking something? I gotta get... I gotta work on my grilling. Like, as a father, I need to be able to cook something, right? Like, that's the rules. I guess not, though. My stepdad was a good dad. He couldn't cook for shit. He used to be like, when my mom, she would make dinner, and then the next day he would just remake, like, leftovers, and then just put cream of chicken on it, and would call it slops, and brother, it's like my favorite thing ever. Is Philly ever going to pave a road, you know? It sounds like I'm fucking driving through the fucking outback. But, you know, what did I have to talk about? There was a fucking mass shooting at the goddamn Chiefs game, or the Chiefs parade. You think it was Patrick Mahomes' brother just trying to get attention? I could see him doing that, just popping a few rounds in the air. I was still I was still dying. I wanted to see Mr. Mahomes, Pat's daddy, with fucking Ice Spice in the goddamn booth. They must have got him out of there. Like, dude, no, can't do it. They had to hire a hooker to keep him occupied. I like that guy. Fucking just smoking black and mild. Sun rich as hell. He's like, yeah, I'll have another DUI. What are you going to do? I did, who was talking, who were we talking about? Who was I talking to? 
I think, I was, I think it was dad meat this week. They were like, yeah, dude, 3D wise in Texas, you go to jail, brother. I was like, that ain't fair. I feel like Texas, you should have as many DUIs as you want. You could own a tiger and not get three DUIs. What kind of fucking sense does that make? Yeah, what? That doesn't make any... You can have fucking tigers? Texas stinks. I'm so dumb with everybody with the fucking Texas. Texas is the best. Texas, Texas... I mean, Austin is specifically... Specifically. Specifically. Jesus. Yeah, Austin is just LA with cowboy hats. It's the same goddamn city. The Mexican food hits. Them boys cooking up. What? Where am I? What is from Lancaster? I don't want to drop my location, but what can you do? Yeah, dude, it was Valentine's Day last night. Did you guys get some puss? Did you guys get some little puss? Little puss puss? My girl's so real. I got fucking hit up last minute to do... Did I? Did we talk about this? I, I can't remember what I talked about because I just fucking recorded a podcast that I didn't record it. Idiot. Lancaster. How can you get through that? I ain't going to go that way, though. I'm driving on to U- the University of Penn's can What? That's an MLK bust. But his eyes ain't looking right. Like, who did that? It looks like I made that in fucking fourth grade. Like, what? I guess, they, do you, like, vet out? Like, how do you win a bid? Like, that is terrible. He's giving side eye. They just made Mar- Marvin gay. He had a dream, too. He had a dream to not get shot by his dad while he was cross-dressing. You guys know that? Was his dad like a cross-dressing priest? What the fuck am I talking about? Back it up. Back it up. Airtech lifestyle. I love it. Every fucking heroin addict has a specific limp. That's how you got on pills, bad car accident. I've heard the story a thousand times. I just saw a guy in a fucking prep school hoodie doing some AV wiring. I'm like, life and it goes to thought. I was going to say Joseph A. Bank University, but that's not a thing. What's that? What's St. Joe's Prep? That's what I'm thinking of. St. Joe's Preparatory. Is that where I got to go? I forget where the fuck I was going, man. On my way to a job to move some goddamn lights around Powelton. Here we go. Now we're cooking. Well, oh, my God. I'm about to start one of the worst jobs I've ever done. Not worst, but like hardest, and I don't want to do it. I think I got to tell my boss, I'm like, dog, the newborn baby's taxing me mentally. I'm going bald. Just kidding. You know, I, um, what the fuck do I got coming up, dude? I better get, if I don't get in Skankfest this year, I'm going to show up and pull a fucking, you know, I'm going to do something bad. I look like shit, brother. I don't know if it's just this lighting. The winter sun is not forgiving on the face. I, uh, dude, my girl's so real that, yeah, we were supposed to get fucking chicken wings for Valentine's Day. Did you guys, like, go out and do an expensive dinner? I gave up on that when I was, like, 22. You know? You gotta take your bitch out to a prefix menu. I ain't doing that. Don't you hate that? I hate when you go to a restaurant and it's, like, six things to the tasting menu. I'm like, you're just grouping the worst fucking seven things and make me pay $60 for it, you cunt. Pothole! All right, where am I at? Dude, there's a, um, what's that shit? Raising Canes? They got one of them around here, and, uh, <laughs> it hits. That shit is so good. Well, the chicken fingers are good. I, didn't, I haven't gotten the fries yet. They look like they're a the crinkle cut, and I'm not that big of a crinkle cut guy. You know? I'm not that big into the crinkle cut. Where am I? 40th, okay. 40th University of Penn. They're just knocking down all the projects around here to build more colleges. Where are these people going? This is the problem with capitalism. You can't just keep knocking down affordable housing so fucking kids can go and change their gender at college. That's not right. Where is everybody supposed to live? Maybe I'll start complaining about capitalism. You know? I'll start doing stand-up about state legislation and shit like that. That lady looks like fat... Uh, what's her name? Mm, I gotta stop shaming women on this. I gotta stop. I gotta start being nicer to broads. Now that I have a daughter, I'm like, yeah, all women are geniuses. They're all smarter than me. They don't have to go fucking put up scaffolding in a church to change lights they've done three times. I'm not gonna complain here, but it is what it is. You know? Boston Market. I'm in West Philly. Dude, they used to do, um, I don't even know if they do it anymore. I always think thing, things stop because I don't do them anymore. I'm like, they used to do, oh, baby bassing out on the side of the road. What's your story, Morning Glory? What happened to that baby? Dark Arts. 
You always see random shit like that on the side of the road. And you're like, that is a bummer. Bummer city, dude. Throw it in the garbage. But yeah, they used to have... We used to go to this thing called Aaron Express. And you would just get blacked out. Get into a fight with some guy from a different neighborhood than you. You know? Go get in a fist fight with a guy from Delco. Because you're like, we're enemies. Even though we live an hour, like 45 minutes apart from each other. And then the older you get, you're like, oh, it's the same guys. I will maintain that guys from Delco are smaller than the guys from the north region of Philadelphia. They make them shorter. More track suits. Maybe better haircuts, because everybody had the Mayfair fade for fucking forever. Remember when you used to get hooks on your sideburns? What the fuck were we thinking with that? I had a barber, Yuri, that I was like, Yuri, hit me with the hook, brother. And looking back on it, I'm like, Ryan, you look retarded. Not as bad as that lady's haircut. Jesus Christ. But I'm at this job now. I'm here. This podcast is over. I'm so sorry it sucked. You know? One day, I will get used to not sleeping. And I will have my energy back. And I will be funny. And that's a promise. You know? I need to start getting into politics, dude. I'm 35. I could run for president. You know? Maybe I'll start doing that. I'll get politically involved. You know? Is this... That's handicapped. I mean, technically, I am handicapped. I have a kid, right? I identify as handicapped. What would I, I mean, I do have a bad ankle. Maybe I should get a handicap placard. What I really would like to do is just go find a doctor that'll give me disability and I'll get paid by the government forever, you know? I'll try to put out another podcast tomorrow, but I'm doing the best, dude. I'm doing the best I can. I got no fucking commute. I only got to talk for, I would have done a fucking half hour today. You could have heard this rambling nonsense for a half an hour instead of 10 minutes, but, you know, you know here's a scrap. Thank you for watching this. Thank you for watching this. Thank you so much. Everybody's wearing these hokas now. Is that supposed to be the thing? I can't wear those, dude. I'll be like 6'7". I'll look fucking crazy. Well, God bless you all. I hope you have a good weekend. I hope Valentine's Day. I hope you got pussy. Look at this parallel park job, <laughs> chief. Definitely a woman. Lesbian, Subaru, guaranteed. Tough. Tough sled. Bye.